To serve and protect, right now, dozens of officers in Lawrence who were willing to take the pledge will soon retire. That's why those with the police department are now asking the city for a million dollars to hire new officers. Yeah, the now KC's Allison Brunner spent the day in Lawrence and tries to explain what's going on over there with this controversy. Not only is this a big request for funding, but it's also a big task for the city manager here in Lawrence, who's new on the job. He's been on the job for less than a week. This is more of a process type issue that I've questioned. And so I want them to understand that as a brand new city manager here in the city of Lawrence, that I probably have a little different perspective on how things are done. The process in question is over hire. We're talking about how to make up the difference while well, those new hires are in training and out on the street with a field training officer. This year alone with retirements plus another seven on average who leave for other reasons, the Lawrence Police Department is looking at a loss of about 19 people. We've been communicating with the city manager uh, for years on this particular topic. In fact, it was the city manager that authorized that overhire for the last several years. Right now, the police department is asking the city for about a million bucks to hire 17 new officers, a hiring need this new city manager understands stands, but wishes it was talked about before the city's budget was finalized. If it had occurred at that point, and the discussion was held at that point, we could have adjusted tax rates or, or other uh, flows of revenue. The challenge is, where is the money going to come from? This could mean no money for the city to pay for things like natural disasters. However, if the city commission doesn't approve the overhire, it could create another issue. When we're short, you know, hold times for calls go up, and I don't think anybody wants to sit on the curb waiting for an officer to arrive after finding that their home has been broken into. Issues the new city manager says aren't being overlooked. And I'm confident. Um, that we'll figure out the right number for this. If we get to a point where we're actually behind on our staffing, it sometimes takes a couple of years for us to get back up to our authorized strength. The city has approved over hires for the past three years. The city commission will meet tonight at 545 at City Hall. In Lawrence, Allison Bruder reporting for the Dow KC. And the Lawrence Police Department must go through the city commission to get the money to hire more officers. The department hopes to hire at least 14 new officers this year, and we'll let you know what happens.